Who's the boss? Kevin Hayes, sir. Yeah, there's yeah. yeah. probably poison on his pocket. Yeah. Keep it going back, you so cold. Yes, sir. Fight fine. This is you. Get back. Get back. Hey, Keith. 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 Hey,
the fact that this sparring clip got leaked, you know, people are like, oh, this is a travesty. What happens in the gym stays in the gym. And I could get it if you're really about that. Like some people are really private. Some fighters, um, they live by that code. But this is more so not towards the fighters who believe in that, but to the fans. Because the fans, they, they treat boxing, they do it like a train wreck. They'll watch the clip and share the clip and then be mad that the clip is released. You know, when Gervonta Tank Davis was punishing Ivan Redcash and stuff and sparring in the league, sparring, you've seen the same thing. But again, oftentimes black fighters, oftentimes fighters that old media hates and stuff like that, where they have a problem with it. But I've seen sparring clips of Canelo leaked on Canelo, you know, through Eddie Reynoso and Canelo was bodying the opponent. You know, at the end of the day, when these things do happen, you can imagine it's probably going to be a clip that makes them look on point and look look like a force. So, you know, I've seen it with, I can't say all fighters, but I've seen it with a lot of, of fighters where the sparring got leaked and it is what it is. So I just wish boxing fans and old media would be consistent with their rule with that. Like, if you don't like it, don't watch it. Don't support it. You know, you, you hate when sparring clips. Why are you even on my video? Because the video the metadata and the title is going to reveal what the clip is about. And once again, people are hypocrites where they'll admonish fighters for leaking the sparring. But as soon as I make a video about it, or as soon as the clip is posted, they're right there all in the video, all in the comments and watching it. And you know, everything else is shareable content online and they have an opinion on it. So you know, pay it no mind if, if if you if you live by that code. Stick to your guns. Stick to what you believe in. So I, I did see some people that were, you know, they were hating on Devin Haney saying, oh, why'd you leak this? Someone should break your nose and, you know, all this goofy stuff. But nonetheless, it should be a, a great fight with him and Jorge Linares. I'm picking Devin, as I mentioned earlier. And we'll see how it all plays out. Also, use my link in the description to get two, buddy. It takes money to make money. I've been using TubeBuddy for years. I use it for videos like this. Start off at zero subscribers. Now we're over 200,000. Oh my gosh. And you know, TubeBuddy is a great browser extension. Dig into it. A lot of features that you can't find readily available on regular YouTube. So it can assist with the upload process. Let me know what you guys think of Devin Haney. He looks good. Looks sharp. Got both his hands healthy. And I'm looking forward to the Lenata's fight. See how he does. Guys like Tio Fimo and Ryan Garcia, they were telling Devin Haney fight a top 10 guy. Well, Jorge Linares is that, so there can be no excuses. Hopefully we get some of those bigger fights if Haney pulls through with the victory. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Let me know how I did in this video. 2021 is up. As always, hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego. Signing off.